The following video will guide you through the recommended maintenance steps to help keep your Blomberg appliance running trouble-free. Further information on these steps can be found in the operation manual and should be referred to in conjunction with this video. If you have lost or misplaced your manual, you may be able to find one on our website. Failing this, please feel free to contact our customer service department who will be happy to assist. Before carrying out any of the following, please ensure that the appliance is switched off, isolated from the mains and that any water remaining within the drum has cooled. The filter protects the drain pump from potential damage from foreign objects, like coins or buttons, during the discharging of water. It's located on the bottom right-hand side of the appliance and should be cleaned every three months or whenever it becomes clogged. To access the filter, open the flap. Before you open the filter housing, remember that there will always be water behind it. To help remove this water, many models have an emergency draining hose. Unclip and lightly pull this hose forward. Place the hose end over a shallow tray and remove the blue cap. The water will then start to flow. Repeat this process until no further water drains from the hose. It's very important then that the blue cap is refitted and placed back in its original location. If your appliance doesn't have an emergency drain hose, the water behind will need to be slowly drained via the filter as it is very slowly removed. The filter can then be removed by rotating it in an anti-clockwise direction. Once removed, check and clean the filter and its housing. To refit the filter back into its housing, slide it in and secure it by turning in a clockwise direction. Run a short program and check for leaks. To ensure that the detergent and softener travel into the drum, the detergent drawer should be removed and cleaned every four to five cycles. To remove the drawer, slide it open and press on the top of the softener compartment. Lift out the softener cover and wash all parts in warm water. Ensure that the inside of the cover is thoroughly cleaned, as if it's blocked, the conditioner will not empty when in use. Whilst the drawer is removed, also remember to clean the underside of the drawer. To refit the drawer, ensure that the softener cap is placed back into the drawer and slide closed. Residue from softeners, detergents and dirt may accumulate in the appliance over time and this may cause unpleasant odours. To avoid this, use the specific drum cleaning program if your appliance has this feature or select a cotton program above 70 degrees with extra rinse function. Do not use the pre-wash option or place any laundry in the drum. Place approximately 100 grams of anti-limescale powder or similar into the detergent compartment and start the program. Once the program ends, clean around the door seal and the inner door with a dry cloth and check the seal for damage or trapped items. The drain holes can also be cleared if required. It's recommended that this procedure is carried out every couple of months. If you have any questions regarding these maintenance steps, please feel free to contact our customer service team with the model and serial number of the product and they will be happy to assist.